Probably one of the most misunderstood animals in your yard are garter snakes. Garter snakes are actually more common in urban areas around towns and cities than they are outside of towns and cities. Now we have several types of garter snakes in Nebraska, but we have to remember one thing. In Nebraska, if it has a line going down its body, no matter what color that line is, as long as it's going down the length of the body, usually on the top of the body or on both sides, it's one of our garter snakes. Garter snakes can get up to three foot or a little bit bigger in size, and they usually like tall grass. So if you let the grass get tall, you're liable to have garter snakes around. Now in the spring, we find what we call aggregations of garter snakes, in which the male comes around and the females, and they get in big groups. While garter snakes cause no problems to the landscape, many people fear them. However, they have no germs and viruses that we found that are transmittable to people. If you don't like garter snakes and you prefer not to have them in your yard, some of the things you can do is keep your grass mowed as short as needed. Do not let it get overgrown. Usually keep it at two to three inches and that will keep a lot of garter snakes away because predators will get to them. Also, clean up piles of brush. Rock walls should be a nice tight rock wall. When there's spaces between rock walls or tie walls, they love that. When it comes to some of the repellents, we've tested a lot of the repellents at UNL and we found out that those repellents are not functional at keeping the snakes away from the yard. In some cases, some repellents even act as an attractant to the snakes. So if you really want to keep them away, one of the things that we did that seems to work that we're testing is to use lava rock landscaping. Lava rock is sharp. The snakes don't like to bask on it and they have a very hard time burrowing into the lava rock. So lava rock about six inches deep by two foot wide around the home. This is not a good place to plant plants, but it's excellent this way to stop the snakes from getting around the home. Another common way people get snakes in the home is through cracks and crevices. Snakes cannot make their own hole into the home. Therefore, caulk and seal all cracks and crevices around the home. So first, try to live with the garter snakes. They're not gonna cause any problems to children or pets. In fact, out of the 29 snakes we have in Nebraska, only four are venomous. So if you see a snake, just walk the other way. They're not gonna cause a problem to you, your pets, or your landscape.